Under federal law, anyone convicted of domestic violence cannot purchase a firearm. But the Air Force failed to inform federal law enforcement authorities that Kelly was court-martialed for assaulting his wife and cracking her son's skull. When he tried to buy guns after his release from a military prison, his conviction was not in the database used to conduct background checks, and the purchases went through. How does federal law enforcement check someone's background for a gun purchase? A licensed gun dealer submits the paperwork to the FBI to run a background check. There are essentially three databases that combine make up what is known as the NICS, or National Instant Criminal Background Check System. Records are searched in the National Crime Information Center, which contains restraining orders and warrants, the Interstate Identification Index, which holds convictions, and the NICS Index, which has mental health commitments and dishonorable discharges from the military.